Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 video. In this video, we're going to be buying and reviewing Blood Eagle Bundle. So let's start wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so before I start reviewing all of the items, the original price for this bundle is 1,800 atoms. Uh, the first time I made it to the Atomic Shop was the 15th of June 2021. It includes the Power Armor uh, skin, it re includes uh, Pickled Brain, uh, Laser Grid Door, so we can't see it how it goes over here, but here's an example how it should look. But you will see it in this video just in a second. Then we've got the actual Skull Lord outfit, the helmet and the war suit. So let's get on with the uh, reviews. All right, so we're going to start off with the outfit because the outfit is freaking great. <laughs> it's like, it's just gorgeous. I absolutely love it. And it's, I think it's going to be one of my favorite. I think it is one of my favorite outfits right now. I also made a few combos. Maybe I'll figure out something else. Uh, with this uh, outfit, but anyway, uh, once you claim it, in order to get your outfit, you will need to use your armor workbench and craft it over there. So you will need to navigate all the way to letter S at the uh, headerware section and at the outfit section. So right now you're looking. This is my main character. By the way, it looks great with the flamethrower skin from season four. Uh, and uh, this monikin here is a female so you can see the outfit on a female character as well uh, let me remove that uh, gun yeah. also I've picked the backpack <laughs> which suits this uh, outfit the best in my opinion and you'll see it right now alright so this is from the front look at all these skulls man I really love that this shoulder has like it's a big massive shoulder and it's got two skulls over there the mask itself is great with a lot of skulls <laughs> as well <laughs> man this this is definitely the craziest and the name of the outfit really fits skull lord so definitely <laughs> skull lord man all right so this is how it looks from the front by the way those eyes actually glow so if you're like in the dark section, like over here, for example, you can see that the eyes are glowing. And here is a screenshot of one of our Z Clan members who made the photo during the night. So you can see those uh, eyes glowing over there. And uh, this is where I stole the idea with the skin of the flamethrower. By the way, Reverse Hollow is the creator of these epic screenshots at our follow uh, on our discord atom shop uh, chats so if you want to stay updated the guys are here a lot faster than my videos come <laughs> all right so I've spoken about the shoulders man the amount of skulls once again is crazy the gloves are great look at this this is crazy man wait is it different no the same it just looks from here Although since my guy is moving, like you can see the arm clipping through the skull. <laughs> kind of sucks. But anyway, it don't matter. Look at that. That's crazy. Steel or boots. Man, this is definitely some crazy outfit. It's from the side. This gloves look looks a little bit different. From the one that we got on this side so it's right left right and left the black pit boy skin essentially I use it all the time is my, my favorite skin for everything pretty much because it fits everything that's the backpack I was talking about it's got a skull too <laughs> <laughs> and it's from the Raider content uh, bundle. Uh, previously, it was locked be behind a pay paywall, but in 2021, it actually did make it to the Atomic Shop. At the moment, it's not available, so stay put at the Atomic Shop notifications, and you will be notified as soon as this backpack skin comes back. Uh, that's how the back looks like. Also, really nice. Look at that wire stuff, man. It's crazy. 
and uh, just to show it to you on a male character, these guys are all male. That's how it looks on a male character on the back. Pretty much identical, I would say. Yep. So, yeah, that's the helmet. It's crazy. Those eyes, man. That crown, man. Although, you know, the crown kind of big, man. If you play third person, then how you look, man. It's, you look huge. But still, very playable, especially if you're using VATS, no problemo. Everything is good. Alright. I'll get to my combos a little bit later. Uh, once again, armor workbench. You go to neither head aware or out or outfits, depending on what you want to craft, and scroll all the way down to your ass letter. That's where you find uh, the helmet or the outfit, depending on what wh which section you're looking for. Right there, you go. So that's the helmet. Once again. Uh, the outfit we don't need to show it like that and don't look good all right uh, then let's start with the power armor shall we so the power armor I made two power armors and they are identical so and one with a jetpack which I recommend using because it kind of matches the style but uh, unfortunately the skin does not give you a jetpack so this is without the jetpack right and as you can see there identical and I really love these turbo things man these turbo things are really freaking great look at that that is insane it makes this I don't know man like transformer stuff <laughs> bumblebee <laughs> look at that from the front it's crazy looking good man looking good look at those wheels over there with the spikes Sheesh. By the way, this is the uh man, I forgot what what was it? Uh damn it. I'm gonna have to jump into this one. To tell you which oh wait, I, 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 I this is the red rocket uh ranger skin. Yeah. Anyway, let's jump into this guy. Oh wait. Yep. Yeah. Pip boy turns on, not the gloves. I always forget to use this thing to see if from where the light's gonna come out. It would be really cool if it come, came out from the eyes and make it red. You know, that would be really cool. But unfortunately, that is not what we have. All right, so there we go with the power armor. Let's see how it looks in the first person. Uh, by the way, I didn't show the first person for uh, the actual outfit. So with the arms. Uh, well, yeah, this is the most craziest weapon. <laughs> it blocks the entire screen. Let's take something smaller. There you go. It's good. Nothing else is sticking out from the arms and stuff like that. So, yeah, it's all good. Hello, hello. Well, power armors need to use heavy guns, man. Oh, hold on a second. That's not really nice, is it? The Crusader is sticking out. But well, who cares? I still like this power armor. <laughs> That's good. All right, the eye. Oh, oh, do do. Where are you coming? Oh, nice. This is coming out right from this helmet over here. That's cool. Really nice. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. All right. I think we can call it at the end for the power armor reviews, right? Uh, just a quick one, just to double check that I got that I named the correct jetpack. But essentially, right now it's not on on the atomic shop, but when it will come back, definitely. Yeah, there you go, Ranger jetpack, the Red Rocket Ranger, something like that. It's a also pretty cool uh, skin for the uh, power armor. Makes it look like all this red style, shiny style, man, it's looking good. All right, then the door is really nice. I love it, and it looks really freaking good with the glass uh, walls. The glass walls I got from uh, season two. Yeah, season two. I don't remember if it ever made to the Atomic Shop, 
So I can't even tell you that for sure. Uh, and uh, not all items that got claimed through seasons uh, returned to the atomic shop. Just like we saw a few so far by uh, 15th of June 2021. Maybe they're going to start reselling all the rewards at the atomic shop, which I'm pretty sure. So you can activate the door, deactivate it, right? Lit with lasers. It's actually really nice. Uh, the thing is that this is a door, so you will need to build it. You, you'll find it in the door section on the build a uh, build menu. So that's the door right here, and bam. Well, can I put another door? No way. No way. No way! <laughs> wow! That is cool, man! That is cool! I did not know that! That is freaking sweet! Uh. Let's see if we put something else. Like the secret door will not work though. So it looks like not all doors work. The hell? Ah, that's what it is. So if you turn it off. Uh -huh. That's what it is. And check this out. Secret door, huh? Boom. Turn it on. This is also the anatomic shop version, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Though. Poof. <laughs> Man. <laughs> and you can. Hold on. You can lock this as well. Like double lock. Boom. And lock this one as well. <laughs> So if some sneaky cockroach wanna get inside your base, man, he gonna have to lockpick twice. <laughs> Wait, hold on a second. Can I actually put a door behind? <laughs> this is gonna be cool, man. Wait, first we need to deactivate this. Ah, yeah, right. I wish. <laughs> but still, you gotta admit that is actually pretty cool. That is cool. And we've got the brain thingy. Uh, which is animated, but you can't actually, you know, kind of click to activate it. It just moves. And you can build it at the uh, floor decor section. There you go. So you need to scroll down and uh, find it. It's individual. It's not linked with any other items right now so far so having that in mind and there's no really limit on how many of these you can build oh excuse me I freaking love it man <laughs> this is great this is a good bundle man alright so those were uh, pretty much all the items that were included within this uh, bundle so the outfit the power armor the laser door and that brain thingy and I'm pretty sure I didn't miss anything so yeah and these are a little bit of my personal creations maybe I'll be able to do a better job later I, I really like this one actually and this is the sack hood which is really hard to find this one right here uh, but it's not atomic shop this I don't remember I think it's season or atomic shop don't know uh, the surgical gas mask is uh, you can buy at the Sutton station. Uh, that's the black cowboy hat. Uh, white springs on a wheelchair. Uh, and the glove club. I'll, I'll show you the location right now. And the uh, bandit, bandit mask. Uh, atomic shop version goes with an outfit. And that's the bog mask, if I'm not mistaken. Follow first also looks pretty nice with the outfit as well as well although it would be really nice if 
this back end would fit this uh, kind of like under armor of this outfit. So yeah, uh, let me quickly tell you two locations where I found this one and where I found uh, where you can find the black uh, cowboy hat. Black cowboy high hat, White Springs Golf Club. You enter the building, go downstairs, turn right, turn left. You'll see the two doors. Get to the door, turn left. You'll see the wheelchair, and you'll see on the wheelchair the uh, the cowboy hat. Uh, the sack hood I found in Morgantown. Yeah, but it's a random occasion. There is a location. Actually, let me show it to you. There is a location that uh, gives you gives you a whole bunch of different outfits, and they are all randomized. So there is a chance. A very slight small chance that you can get that sack hood so uh, this is where you're gonna spawn in all you gotta do is just run straight keep running straight get all these ghouls it would be funny if I found if I find one right now <laughs> all right and you need to go to those walls over there. Right there, it's right in front of us. And inside this tent, there's like six or seven outfits, also fully randomized. So we got the blue bandana here. So, nope, nothing interesting. And then the sack hood I found right here instead of that great thick cat so it's gonna be very hard to spot it if it's gonna be spawned in because it's like a flat thing so if you'll be passing through this location by the way it's also some uh, mines and outfits over here but they're not here this time Alright Z-Clan, this is where I'm going to be calling it the end for this video, so I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, you know the drill, don't forget to hit that like, comment down below, please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube, nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So if you got something to say, feel free to comment, the only thing I ask of you is not to swear. So you can provide your negative, positive feedback, whichever, just don't swear. And if you're new and you subscribe, well, welcome to Z Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine. Once again, thanks a lot for watching this video. If you want to join our Discord, feel free to do so. The link is down in the video description. Make sure to read our rules because if you break them, you get banned permanently. And uh, that's it, you're gone. <laughs> Follow the instructions if you want to get access to the correct chats, as the Discord is big. Up so far, it's over 850 members. Uh, so we have chats for Fallout 76, trade chats in general, maybe because we're going to be fi uh, fitting in those trade chats with other MMO games. Uh, we have separate uh, games, chats for other games uh, uh, with a list. We have some social chats like recommend a movie, food fight, and other stuff. So it's actually pretty cool. Pretty fun place to hang out. And yeah, thanks all for watching. Oh yeah, did I say the cool part? We got a chat where you can type a bot command and get the nuke codes <laughs> anyway thanks a lot for uh, stopping by I hope you enjoyed this video you know the drill and you all have a good morning day and night bye from the ashes we rose into the future we'll go we are the clan we have a gamer soul by the Yeah.